Animal diseases can be spread easily from farm to farm and across the countryside when livestock and poultry are transported. Dirty trucks and trailers might carry pathogens down the road onto other farms or ranches and into facilities. For biosecurity, follow these guidelines if you will be picking up livestock or poultry. The farm or ranch probably has designated one secure entry point for empty trucks coming in. The farmer or rancher may give you a phone number or may post a sign that provides the phone number to call or gain admittance to the premises. They should then admit only vehicles they trust won't contaminate the operation or that they can examine before entering. Your contact may inspect the truck and trailer before you enter the premises. If there's mud or manure, you may be asked to leave to clean the equipment thoroughly or be directed to cleaning facilities outside the premises. You may be asked to sign a log of when you enter and leave, provide contact information, and confirm what condition your equipment is in when you arrive and depart. You should be shown what route to take on the operation and where to load. Before animals are loaded for transport, examine the required paperwork. A certificate of veterinary inspection, which is commonly called a CVI or health certificate, may be required or may be optional if the animals are going directly to slaughter. This certificate is required if livestock are transported across state lines. The rules vary among states, so contact your state animal health official, state veterinarian, or local vet to clarify requirements. A certificate of brand inspection may be required to confirm that cattle have brands on them for proof of ownership. A bill of lading describes what's on the truck, typically the number of animals in each class. A bill of sale confirms a change of ownership, like a receipt. Make sure you have clean footwear and coveralls when loading and any time around animals. Before animals are loaded, make sure cleanouts are closed on trailers. This will keep manure from being released during the trip. Confirm that clean and not reused bedding is on your truck. With the farmer or rancher, examine animals as they're being loaded. Don't load sick or injured animals. Instead, work with the producer to sort them out for examination and possible treatment. When done loading, double check the paperwork to confirm the number of each class of animal loaded and make sure all gates are closed. Log when your truck leaves the premises and any other information that should be recorded. If you're delivering animals to a farm or ranch, again, call to gain admittance to the premises, follow the route given, and sign in if requested. Before animals are unloaded from transport, examine the required paperwork with the producer. These may include a certificate of veterinary inspection, certificate of brand inspection, bill of lading, bill of sale, before or while animals are unloaded, work with the producer to verify and document numbers and classes of animals. For example, the number of cows, gilts, or ewes, and possibly each animal's identification, such as ear tag or ear notch. If an animal looks sick, work with the producer to separate it from the others as soon as possible. The new animals could infect on-premises animals with a contagious disease. If possible, after unloading, move your transportation equipment to a cleaning area where it can be hosed down to remove manure before it goes back on the road or to another farm or ranch. If not possible immediately, complete a thorough clean-out as soon as possible. So whether you're delivering new animals to an operation or transporting off the premises, these procedures will help you keep the animals healthy.